Coach, uh, big victory last weekend. It wasn't pretty, but uh, you got the W. Talk about the game last week. Um, yeah, there was a – maybe there was a lot of things that weren't pretty about it, but uh, like you said, the win is a win, and it's something we really needed. Um, I thought our kids played extremely hard. It was a very, very physical game. And any time you get two schools that close, you know, you expect that kind of physicality. Um, but uh, – in the process, we, we did lose um, a couple of ball players due to injury. Uh, nothing serious, just uh, they'll probably miss this week. And um, it could, uh, we're gonna have to, we're gonna have to do a few things, smoke and mirrors, I think this week, with a few players to, to get by. We're kind of short in numbers, so. Talk, talk about your point of this week's center line. They uh, got their first one last week. Yeah, they're, they're um, you know, this whole league is, is pretty comparable. It's pretty even. Uh, Numbers-wise, roster-wise, I think talent-wise, you look at them, I've pretty much seen everyone. And uh, there, there's no one that's really head and shoulders above anyone. But the problem with that is on any given Friday, um, someone's hot, someone's having a good a good game, that could change the, the whole outlook of the game. So all we can do is prepare just fundamentally for basically what they do and hope we go out and, and execute. What's been the, the bright point this this year so far? I mean, Smiley's having a really great year on the ground, but can you talk about a couple of kids that have stood out so far? Well, I think the key um, the key has been our offensive line and uh, even the defensive line. I know when I got here, it was the big question mark was, you know, well, we don't have any linemen. They're all young. They're this and that. And fortunately, I was able to bring Mark Shue um, along, who had been my coach. Um, excuse me, Mark Shea, who had been my coach for uh, – at Loyola for years and years. And be, prior to that, he was a head coach at Cabrini. So he has a, a world of, uh, of knowledge. And he's taken that offense and defensive line and turned it into a, a really precise unit. And you're right, Smiley has had um, an outstanding year, as JJ has too. But without that line, um, there wouldn't be much there. So they, they kind of complement each other. Okay, well, good luck this week. I appreciate it. Thank you.